Hey everyone, it's Houndex here, and in today's video, I'm going to be going over some RTX 30 series laptops that are going to be priced under $1,200. But before we begin to the video, if you haven't already, consider subscribing if you're new to the channel. It really helps me out a lot, and especially if you're interested in this kind of content. The first laptop I'm going to be covering in this video is priced at around $1,000, which is the MSI GF65. For $1,000, it's probably the lowest price you can pay for to get a laptop with a 3060 GPU. This laptop used to be available for pre-order, but now it's set to coming soon. The laptop features an RTX 3060, which is most likely the Max P version. It also has an Intel i5-10200H, which is slightly less powerful than the i5-10300H, and it has a 15.6 inch and a 144Hz display panel, which is pretty nice for some gamers. Overall, I think this is a solid deal for an RTX 3060 gaming laptop, given the $1000 low price. My only concern about this laptop is the memory, and I highly recommend you upgrading from 8GB of RAM to 16GB. A lot of AAA games use a lot of your RAM, so it may be worthwhile upgrading to avoid memory bottlenecks. The next laptop I'm going to be covering is the Asus Tough Dash F15. Similar to the MSI gaming laptop, it has an RTX 360, which is the max queued version, according to the spec sheet on the Asus website. You get an i7-1137H 4-core 8-threaded processor with 16 gigs of RAM. This laptop is actually available for pre-order, and for $1,100, I think it's an excellent deal. The next laptop I'm going to be covering in this video is one from Gigabyte, which is the G5. It is priced at $1,100, and it's actually available for pre-order. Now, this laptop has some really good specs for only $1,100, and my favorite part is the 240Hz display panel. Again, it has an RTX 3060 GPU, which is probably the Max-Q or the Max-P version, which is expected at this price range. And during these past few months, I haven't seen that much Gigabyte gaming laptop deals, and they've always been priced very high, so it's surprising to see this one. So personally, I would list this as one of my top picks. And finally, the last few gaming laptops I'm going to be talking about are going to be from Lenovo. And we don't know the exact pricing for each model except the starting point. But Lenovo claims that their Lenovo Legion 5 series coming soon are going to have a mobile Ryzen 7 5800H processor and up to an RTX 3070 Max-Q. Now the past gaming laptops I've discussed in this video contain Intel processors, so if you want a gaming laptop that has an AMD processor, then this is something you should consider. Now with that said, I'm still recommending these series. Lenovo has some really good build quality and has one of the cleanest designs in their gaming laptops. In fact, the model I have, which is a Lenovo Legion 5 with an AMD Ryzen 7 4800H with a GTX 1660 Ti, delivered some great value and I was very satisfied with that gaming laptop. So that's going to be it for today's video, and if you're looking for an RTX 3060 laptop right now, then my top pick would personally be the Gigabyte G5 gaming laptop. But if you can wait a little longer, then maybe the Lenovo Legion series might be a better option because they generally have better build quality and a cleaner design. So if you find this video helpful, remember to leave a like down below, that helps me out a lot, and I'll see you all in the next one.